Hi, I'm Shayla and I'm going to talk tonight about some oils for the classroom. I just got home from talking with some people about oils to use in the classroom to help with different things um, now that you know school year is almost underway now <clears throat> and so I thought you know why not just put it in a video real quick um, about my top oils that I the first things that come to my mind that's the, the first oils that come to my mind when someone asks well what oils do you use in your classroom um, these are like my top six that come right out of my mouth uh, so I want to talk about them um, super quick like and then um, as my school year gets underway and I get to know my kids a little bit more and I get to know um, some of their disabilities and their strengths and their challenges uh, I will um, change it up a little bit with some more specific oils that target those because I'm a special education teacher and so there are certain oils that target certain um, disabilities and so I will you'll hear about those in other videos to come um, but to start off beginning of the school year these are my top six that I have um, so to help with the back to school jitters and anxiety and things that come with a new transition getting back into routine of things I'm going to be using serenity which is the restful blend it is for you know sleep and things like that but uh, it also is a huge huge help with anxiety and um, and over excitement of things which peace is also that and I have it in the, the touch here which is a roller um, so I this piece also comes in a bottle just like this so I can diffuse it um, just like I can diffuse serenity or you can use it as a roller and you can roll it on the back of your neck on the inside of your elbow joints um, the wrists um, depending on schools depending on you know what's available you can maybe put this on the children as well um, or you can diffuse it like just like you can serenity and serenity can be put on the skin as well so you, I have those two to help kind of calm things down, reassure that everything's going to be okay, we're going to get through this, um, and help with that, that back to school anxiety that kids tend to get, and me <laughs> as well. I get very anxious um, with back to school things. A good anxious, not a bad anxious, a good one. It's a good one. But to help kind of push you through afternoons is going to be citrus bliss. You know, the afternoon after lunch, after recess, we're exhausted, we're tired, we need a little boost of things. Citrus bliss is the invigorating blend. That's going to help pump us up, get us, you know, active a little bit. Um, also, another good one to do is the peppermint and wild orange, which is kind of similar to this. Um, those two together help give you that happy feeling and um, ready to kind of work and push through the next hour or two left of school. To help balance some emotions, frankincense and, and balance, the actual balance blend, the grounding blend, and frankincense are my two wonder team. I put them together in a roller um, similar to this and this is the one thing, especially with children with special needs, um, that I have found to be the most effective for overstimulation. Like when they get, um, sometimes children with autism get really overstimulated with some things um, going on, especially again, when we're out of routines, everyone knows like getting back into a routine of actual school is a big thing. But then that first week or two, we you can't get a set schedule because you're introducing everything you're you're learning all kinds of things you're learning about the kids you're learning they're learning about you um our special schedule is all screwed up so frankincense and balance together help with that grounding bringing us back to knowing okay this is really anxious this is really nervous this is really scary 
Um, but we can handle it. We're going to push through. We're going to get ourselves grounded and ready to help each other. Frankincense and Balance is my power team on that. And then, of course, cannot ever go to school without On Guard. Especially children, with children. Children and adults, too. But why? some reason, children seem to have more germs. <laughs> or maybe children want to share their germs more than adults do. So the On Guard is the protective blend. I use this in the soap. I use the soap On Guard. Um, I make my own soap with the On Guard and maybe Serenity because I like the smell and I want to, you know, add that to things. But I, I put this in the soap that's by the sink in the classroom. I use it to wipe down the tables. Um, and the soap that I make is just, you know, just a little bit of the cast aisle soap or even just regular hand soap, you know, the unscented, or maybe if you'd like the scent of some soap that you have, add some drops of the On Guard into it and um, it's to keep, it keeps all bacteria and germs from, it kills them, it keeps them from coming back for, you know, so many days. Uh, it's, it's amazing. It's amazing. My school story with On Guard is, you know, last school year when the flu season was super, super bad, they, it was really bad at our school and, um, my classroom was the only classroom that didn't have any children absent because of a flu sickness, flu virus, cold virus, or anything. Because, I mean, I was diffusing it. I was spreading it on, you know, like I said, wiping the tables down, wiping the chairs down every day after school. I was using the hand sanitizer with it. Um, even just putting, you know, a couple drops in your hand and just rubbing it around on your hands is even good. Um, because it's that protective blend and it's going to help um, fight those germs and keep you germ free. Um, and if you're diffusing it in the air, then it's helping, you know, immune systems, things like that. On Guard being the protective blend also helps with other uh, boundary issues and things like that, that my children, the children in my classroom tend to have a lot of. And, but I will definitely talk about that in another video. So just want to take a really quick moment and go over my powerhouse of oils from the beginning of my school year. These are the six that I am bringing into my classroom first day um, before anything, making sure I'm checking my, my orders now, my list for my August order so that I make sure that I have these already as a, like my classroom set. So that, again, go quickly back over it. This help calm and comfort is going to be the serenity and peace together or separate. You can even use them separate. Um, and then to help boost us, uh, our energy level up, I'm going to do citrus bliss, diffusing that. Um, you can also turn this into a roller as well. Um, that helps. And frankincense and balance are my power team to help balance our emotions and um, balance our feelings, help get us a little bit more grounded. And then the germ, take away all germs and nastiness um, that can accumulate in a classroom is the On Guard. So yes, if you're a teacher, make sure you have these because they're very, very important. Um, if you want to learn more about how to get some oils, then definitely shoot me an email. My information's below. Thanks.